the Hogwarts Express in the background behind the Fast and Furious sign. Because we are heading towards London to go to the train station. <laughs> The show there, we just missed like a fish market. So we can head up towards Hogsmeade. Not Hogsmeade. Diagon Alley. Diagon Alley this side, and then we'll go to Hogsmeade. And there is King's Cross, which is the way you get the train to the other side. We've got the night bus over there. Leicester Square Station, which goes through into Diagon Alley or Diagonally, you can go into Nocturne Alley. Pretty cool. Let's go have a look at the night bus. There is the night bus. It's kind of hot at the moment, otherwise I'd queue up to talk to the guy in the talking head. But there's a big queue of people and it's boiling hot today, so we're going to head through into Diagon Alley. There you go, through the big fancy building. Around the corner. And we're in the wizarding world. You wanna go ride Gringotts? Off to Gringotts we go. I spent like 10 minutes here the other day trying to catch that dragon breathing fire and I just couldn't get it. Didn't see it once, actually, to be fair, so I don't know if it wasn't doing it. I don't know how frequent the fire is. We gotta go past stuff in the locker, we'll probably go single riders. We did that the other day, and it was fine. So, I'll see you on the other side. Okay, Gringotts was a no-go, it's a 60 minute wait, and the single rider line was shut, so we just kind of sat, had a frozen butter beer. And now we are heading over to King's Cross to get the train to Hogsmeade. So this is kind of a goodbye to Simpsons Land over there. Men in Black's over there somewhere as well. Say so goodbye to the night bus because the last time we'll be at Universal Studios this trip because we are going into King's Cross in this corner over here. So bye Universal Studios, it's been fun. Now I've got to go say goodbye to Islands of Adventure as well. So here we go, about to get on that train. Chelsea needs to get our tickets out or we're going nowhere. Thank you, Chel. So you have to have a ticket for both parks in order to get on the train. So make sure you have one of those if you want to get into both parks. Travel London, amazing sights all day and night. I mean, that's not far off, it's pretty good in London. Like, it's a sightseeing. You kind of get used to it when you live there. I think round this corner is that big make a little magic puppy poster way over there. Try and get a nearer shot of it. Make a little magic people with divine magic. By Lima Canero. Oh we gotta go down, back round and still through all of that. I'll see you when we get to the platform. I was all like, yay we made it! Where did that queue come from? It said it was only 30 minutes. We were downstairs for like 35. Oh, but I can't wait to get back on this beauty. It's just about worth it. Just. I mean, it would have taken five minutes just to go out of the park, back in the entrance of the other one, but... The Hogwarts Express is worth it. Where's the food truck? 
come on, you got your contracts for pumpkin pasties. Wrong. Food is the first of the five principal exceptions to Gamp's law of elemental transfiguration. Do you know what she's talking about? <laughs> You guys can see it too, right? Just you can't see it, but in the carriage. I mean, it's like really obvious to see. Hopefully it comes through on the camera. I have to look when I get the footage back home, but I can see it. You guys can too, right? One last look at this. A beautiful Hogwarts Express. And the rest of Hogwarts is Hogwarts in the background. And Hogsmeade. Because we are going to head out the other way. Go look through the stores on this side. I think we're going to head back to Pop. We both find it really hot today, especially after the uh, water park yesterday. Like, really overheating. I think Chelsea's feet are sore. They all got a bit burnt yesterday. My forehead's boy, like, went bright red. So, I'm going to say goodbye to Hogwarts. Goodbye to Hogwarts. We are going to head that way into the rest of the park and then probably on to a cab. If we see anything interesting, I'll show you. If not, I'll see you when we get back to Pop. Okay, I don't even know what the name of this ride is, but on the way out we decided to get on this ride, so we're about to get on this train. Bye, people! She's running off to get a cab without me and she's meant to be paying. I feel like a sucker fool. She's way over there. What? My bag got stuck filling out. She just walked off. Look at her down there. Teasing me, she's gonna run off. Right, to the cab. Bye, Islands of Adventure. You have some cool, like, pirate themed people on stilts for no reason, though. They had ones earlier for the mummy on the other side. I don't know why they do that, but it's pretty cool. Now into the big store, and then we're gonna head out to the cab. I'm not quite sure why we're heading this way. We were meant to be getting a taxi. I think someone wants to head into a certain place. If it's open, there's no one going into it. Is it open yet? I don't know. We'll find out if the chocolate emporium is open. If not, we'll just take some cool pictures to send home. It's not open and she's pierced. I don't think it's open yet. It must be really close though. Because it looks like it's all ready. All the things are spinning. It's a shame. That'd be nice to go into. Oh well. That'll be next visit. Back out. Pop. About to refill our drink. Thank you. We had like every day, nearly every day, we've had someone mention like either one of our shirts, one of our pairs of shoes. So the guy in the cab just mentioned my trainers, which I got from the Adidas outlet or Adidas outlet. And that guy just mentioned my shirt. I'm wearing a wrestling shirt today. And we're going to head into Pop, fill up our refillable mugs, then go have a lay down in the room for like 10, 15 minutes. It's not sure what we're doing, if we're gonna go out tonight, but hey, we're on vacation, let's relax. Okay, so as we return by the background, we're back at Pop. We are in the lift. We're gonna head over to Art of Animation for dinner to go create your own pasta there. So I take you on the short walk across the bridge. And then we're probably just gonna stay in the room and relax for tonight. We've got the whole day at Magic Kingdom tomorrow, including a be our guest lunch. So that should be interesting for you guys to see. We had breakfast there the other day and now we're going to go out there for lunch. But for now we're going to head over to Art of Animation so let's take you for a walk around the lake and across the bridge.
You may recognise this view because I think this is literally the same seat we sat in last time. We might have sat on one table over. But this time, so we got the pasta again. This time I got Alfredo with all the vegetables apart from mushrooms because I don't like mushrooms. Chelsea got a similar thing but with mushrooms instead of olives. And got the marinara sauce. I got a Mickey ganache tart, which we don't have a pop. So that looks cool. Looking forward to eating that. And Chelsea got a Dory cupcake, which looks really cool. And then for drinks, we just got a water and a Powerade. So we're going to sit and enjoy this. And I think that's probably going to be the end of this episode because we're not going to do much more tonight. I think we're going to go back. I think I'm going to go back and watch uh, wrestling. It's NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 2 tonight because I'm a big wrestling fan and give Chelsea a chance to rest because she had a bit of a headache today. We got really overheated yesterday so we, we both need a chance to relax. As I said earlier, Magic Kingdom all day tomorrow with the I guess for lunch. I think we've got a fast pass for Spaceship, not Space Earth, um, Space Mountain who both have never been on before so I am and I'm not looking forward to that at the same time so That'll be coming next episode, and you should see a clip of what happens tomorrow now. Oh, I'm really not looking forward to this. I'm like literally physically shaking right now. I hate things in the dark. I'm Does that count as a Dollar Tree? Hey.